Good morning, you guys. Today is Saturday, February the 15th. And um, today I'm just going to vlog my day. I don't have a lot on the um, agenda for today. <music> Um, and I need to get it expedited because I leave for my line sister's wedding in less than a, well, a little bit over a month. But anyway, so um, today I'm gonna get up. That's my first priority. I do want to go by a few stores and just look around and shop for my baby girl. I have not started shopping for her yet. Everybody else has. Um, and I'm just afraid to. I don't know why. I'm just afraid to shop for her. Um, so soon I look at stuff and I'm like, no, I'm not gonna get it. So I'm just gonna look at something, buy her something today, whether it's just an outfit, um, bottles, or just something today, okay? Um, other than that, I am gonna do a get ready with me, um, with this vlog because. I just want y'all to get ready with me. Yeah, I'm super bored. I'm currently on my balcony. It is a beautiful day. Let me see if I can focus the camera. Beautiful day, you guys. Um, I don't know if y'all can hear the rooster. Um, it's a house that has a barn through these trees. And the rooster, I don't know if he knows how to tell time. Um, he does it all day. Oh, I don't know if it's a myth that they do it at the crack of dawn. Um... But yeah, y'all hear him. He does it all day. And it's currently like 11 or something. So, um, I'm about to get dressed. Um, do get ready with me. So, stay tuned for that. Um, and get my day started. And just take y'all along with me today. Also, um, my grandma, she has stopped eating salt and sugar. And she keeps claiming, I can't eat. I'm not getting full because I can't eat the stuff. I'm used to. Um, first of all, of course we're black. We eat soul food um a lot. So I, I understand what she's saying. One of her favorite foods is pizza. However, she does not eat pizza from restaurants. They have to be homemade pizzas, not the frozen kind, but actually roll the dough out and the pasta and stuff. Since I don't stay with her anymore, um, it's not often I get to do that. So today I decided to do it to make her a veggie pizza because she can no longer eat pork as well. And I'm going to show her how to eat without salt and sugar and still get full. Because she's claiming, I don't get full. I don't get full. And I watched her eat yesterday. And I'm just like, Grandma, you not, you're not doing it right. So, anyways, that's on my agenda today. So, you guys stay tuned. And I will see you later. Um, Excuse my face. Because, baby, girl just woke up. I, well, I've been up. I woke up around 6 and I got back up maybe 30 minutes ago. So, anyways, stay tuned.
be screwed because the post office is about to close at two i went to the wrong post office which online told me to come to this location um but let's catch the light it's the wrong location the other one is like 20 minutes away and they close within the next 20 minutes so i came to walgreens however walgreens only does the photos so it says that the post office is open on monday which is a holiday and i don't know so what i'm about to do is probably give me something to eat because i'm hungry and um i'm just gonna have to try on monday I still have time. I'm a month out. But, yeah. <laughs> Cutting it close. So, I'm going to try on Monday at the post office. And hopefully, they're open. I don't know if they are open, though. But, online, it says they're open. So, finger across. Um, thing one for the day. Uh, getting my passport. Or applying for my passport. Mission failed. Alright, y'all. So, I am in Burlington. And, my mama left me. I think she wanted to shop alone for the baby. But, girl, I don't, I don't know why people hide this stuff from me. Like, don't you have to hide it from the baby. I'm not the one that's going to get it. So, obviously, we have been in the store over an hour. And I'm new mom. Did you guys scroll up with this? Because I cannot pick out baby clothes for nothing. So, I guess my months are off. Because I'm doing June, so doesn't it mean like she's gonna be in summer clothes? So everything I pick up, my mom's like, no. And then they're from the old school, so they believe that newborns are supposed to wear pink if it's a girl, and newborns are supposed to wear blue if it's a boy. They don't believe in reds and different colors for babies. And y'all know I'm the red, so all this pink is irking me. Really? Alright, so I'm in Walmart with my mom. Um, I had to make a grocery store run. She did too, so I just we just came together. But um yeah. She's on my tell it's tax time. Say hey, mom. I see. Yeah, faithfully. Okay, sir. It's a camera right there. So, I'm gonna get out of Walmart because I really gotta get away from home. And I feel like I got nothing accomplished today that I wanted to get accomplished. Such as get my passport, do some baby shopping. Um, I guess both of those mean I didn't spend money today, which I actually did. But I do plan on going to visit my sister because she has moved about three weeks ago and um let's go check our place out okay y'all i have made it to my sibling's house and um yeah she's my sibling until i open this door and determine how friendly she's gonna be she's not my sister until i open this door she's my sibling house Y'all look at my fellow YouTuber. Tell him what your um YouTube is. What? You know I'm like. What's your YouTube? Uh, I follow Jay. Oh, okay. Yeah. 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 Okay.
Yeah. You finna go out the door? Yeah, I told you we had to we had to go to dinner at five o'clock. Who dinner y'all going to? Um, Layla. They finna go. I ain't even get to look around. You got a key? This how the hour work goes. Mom, it was mom. No, it went because mom said she wouldn't even reach you. Mom's a liar. Mom been with me all. Third one. Where y'all going to eat it? I don't know how it's like. It's so legit. Hit that light. Smell good in here. Oh. Baby, that mold, I love me, honey. I'm going to If my baby girl is poking today for real Sheesh. all right let me go i thought you said you had to i do it i hold it all i did was burn that thing out here y'all wait too long i think i'll see 12 o'clock Girl gonna come out bring something. It's four o'clock now. She could have been broke. Might show her how to get here. From my house, she probably don't know her. <laughs> my day, I'm vlogging my day. All right, then. Maybe next time. I'm off the weekend. I mean, I got a three day weekend. I'm out today. I'm off Monday, too. Okay. All right. That's that. Bye. I have about 15, 20 minute ride home. So I just feel like I just rode out here for nothing. So we're going to have a quick talk about um, babysitting. What are you guys, uh, first time moms, how did you guys go about, or moms now, how do y'all, did y'all go about babysitting finding child care for your kids i've always said this and i just thank god that my grandma is still alive and she's able and willing to um babysit my daughter for me while i'm at work um so i just want to ask you guys the question of how did y'all go about child care did you guys let any who did you all let keep your child who you did it because i am going to be very very finicky about that um everybody cannot watch my child everybody cannot watch my daughter um and it's not even just family um uh, friends i'm talking about i'm talking about family too no no everybody cannot watch her everybody cannot hold her um that's just how i was raised everybody did not watch me and i think i was raised perfectly fine and i'm talking in the standpoint of not even trying to be negative but so many other things can happen when your child is in the um presence of other people and they don't have the same beliefs or standpoints as you would um so i just want to know who did y'all let keep your child uh you can comment down below and i'm not a fan of daycares you guys i do not like daycares it's been so much in the media also kids that attend daycare to me they're just always sick not saying i'm gonna try to prevent it but i feel like i'm paying you to get my child sick um I am a teacher. I know daycare kind of helps them learn um, and get them ready for school, but I'm a teacher. I will be, I'm, <laughs> I I can get her uh, ready for school. Also, I, it's a blessing that I have my grandmother because she's gonna teach me so much. Like, the, for example, um, my girl, I was like, grandma, so what is like your biggest concern with the baby? She was like, I just need to make sure her belly button isn't poked out. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> she was like, I just need to make sure her belly wasn't ain't pulled out. And I'm just going to have to watch it for a few days and make sure it's wrapped up right. She was like, because y'all belly button's in. I made sure y'all was in. She was like, it's a certain way you have to wrap it. And being a first-time mom, new 
generation, I do not know that. Of course, I would love for her to have an Emmy. I have an Emmy. Um, to me, that's way more attractive than an Audi. So, um, she just was saying that it's a certain way you have to take care of the belly button while they are young for a couple of weeks in order for that belly button to um, go inside. So, um, that's her only thing she wants to do. So, hey. <laughs> I'm gonna make her happy and let her do that because I do more of it but it's just certain stuff like swaddling I have no idea how to swaddle a baby um and she's gonna be there to teach me not saying my mom is it um but my mom is not as patient as my grandmother is I can see my mom now just give it to me let me swaddle her. let me do it myself versus showing me how to do it uh and my sister is just y'all my sister had me in tears the other day. So much stuff she has about for this baby. And all I could do was cry. I'm gonna be emotional. I'm emotional. It's crap. Um, and she got her so much stuff. And I'm just like, Ashley, like, so I'm just saying, I'll keep saying it. This is Ashley's baby. Um, and I'm just carrying her. But this is Ashley's child. I just know it. One, because I'm super emotional. Um, and I said my sister is super emotional, but I have a feeling she's gonna come out something like her. Um, and I'm not emotional at all. Like I don't wear my heart on my sleeve at all. And I feel like I have been this whole five months that I've been pregnant. So I really feel like it's gonna come out like my sister crying. So, um, I'm a surprise. I'm trying to currently decide when I'm going to release to everybody her name. Um, I think I have just finalized her name. Um, I don't know if I'm going to wait to the baby shower or will I do a vlog of how her name was came. How did I come up with her name? Um, maybe I need to do a vlog of it because my line sister monograms everything. And I know I want some of her baby shower gifts to be monogrammed. <laughs> so, um, I might have to release the name. But if you ask anybody that's really asking me, what do you have a camera name? Are you coming? I'm telling the first name, but her middle name, I wasn't too sure of. But just recently, I um did become positive of what I wanted her middle name to be. As for Taz, I'm just catching y'all up. I'm really catching y'all up on everything. As for Taz, I'm really nervous because that is my firstborn child. Um, <laughs> and I do not want to have to pick between him and my daughter. However, Taz is one. He acts just like me. I, I, can't, I can't fault him for that. Um, he's territorial, especially over me. He's gotten to the state where he only wants, like last night he kept me up all night because he whimpered. And so I thought he had to use the restroom. I let him out two o'clock in the morning made him get back in the cage got him back out because he was still whimpering i was like okay let me check the cage did he pee in the cage has he puke why does he not want to be in the cage honey i went in there let Taz out of the cage this guy decides that he's gonna make a run for it so Taz runs out of the cage and go gets in my bed i said oh no sir we're not finna do this like that's your problem you want to sleep in the bed with me so I had to, and it hurt because I know he wanted to be in bed with me and I don't mind it. And he, he's gotten to the point where he sleeps right up under my stomach. So I think he knows that I'm pregnant, but I don't know if the aggression is coming from protecting me or is the aggression coming from he sees me changing or he knows that there's about to be a change. <laughs>
this vlog out i dropped my grandma's pizza i feel so bad so i'm just gonna give her mine <laughs> it's not funny i dropped her pizza so i'm just gonna give her mine and i'm even gonna show y'all so <laughs> i'm just close out the vlog um see you guys later bye, -bye.